Here in the swatches panel, I have the default CMYK swatches, some colors that I created myself, and some Pantone colors. If I click on this shape just here, I can see that it has a fill color of company primary. Let's copy it to the clipboard. Jumping over to our new blank document, we can see that it contains just the default swatches. Let's now get that shape into this document using either paste or paste in place. The shape comes in, as does the swatch. We can even delete the shape at this point, and the swatch remains. Now, this is great to know, but not the most efficient way to bring in a lot of swatches. In the upper right corner of the swatches panel is a menu. Choose Load Swatches, point to the file with all of the swatches, and here's all of our swatches. So let's get to work. I hope that helps. Catch you later.